Baby, let's go get your shoes. Let's go for a walk. Lias. Let's go. Where are your shoes? Let's go find your shoes. Come on. Where's the cup? Okay, let's get your shoes on. something you hear with your ears yeah. did you hear that with your ears yeah. oh no it broke in two it's okay Where's the sky? Can you point to the sky? Hi guys welcome back to today's vlog i'm feeling tired <laughs> i made myself coffee i feel like i needed to pick me up and i tidied up a little bit 
um elias has been sleeping now for probably like an hour or so and i probably have like hopefully another hour before he wakes up um we went for a walk today uh if you follow me on instagram i've shared how i've been doing these little toddler walks with him and they've been a game changer um it just allows him to feel like he is in charge for a little bit so i let him basically lead the way explore grab rocks pick up sticks play with dirt he did that today um i was actually inspired by melena ciciati another youtuber here and she has been doing this this with her daughter and now her son and it's really just i think it's great for kids to just feel like they have a little bit of a moment to explore without being told what to do and um take the lead i often think about how as a toddler he's constantly being told what to do what not to do it's time to do this we're leaving and so i don't know it's been really 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 good and uh, great for him to just feel like he's in charge of that little small part of his day and of course you know i i try to allow him to make you know take choices or make choices i mean when he when i'm able to give him that but it doesn't always work out that way so this has been really great for him so aside from that i i was looking at my to-do list i need to get some meal planning done um a meal plan for our dinners for the week and i also based off of those meals and those dinners that i plan for the week i do my grocery list and i need to and we get our our groceries delivered we have a local service that just started up in our area that we've been using for about a month and a half or so and it's been a game changer we used to do grocery pickups way before um the pandemic and we continue to do that throughout and then recently i've decided to try this out because obviously you hear a lot about me um grocery delivery services and it really has been a game changer um I feel like I'm able to get them delivered on the weekend and it's for the next week. Usually I meal plan from Monday through Sunday. Um, Mondays or Sundays and Mondays are my husband's days off. So that also allows us to not have to worry about stepping out to pick them up. And then I will literally have them usually delivered on Saturday. It's all typically my goal. So that way sundays and mondays we don't have to worry about being home if we have plans um usually on sundays we go to church and so there's been a few times where we've had them i've had no other choice because the slots for delivery fill up so i've had to have them delivered on a sunday or monday but my aim is always on a saturday so that's why today's thursday i'm trying to get that done and out of the way so that way i know that i can secure a delivery for saturday and um if you guys are interested in how I meal plan or why I meal plan or tips on how to meal plan, let me know. And it's more than just meal planning for us, um, but also I don't know about you guys, I'm a big foodie. And so when I see people just share anything food, whether it's grocery hauls or meal planning or what they meal plan for the week, I love those videos because it gives me ideas. And something I also find really fascinating is I think that every family has different staples in their pantry and in their fridge that they restock on every week. And so I just like to know those types of things because sometimes it I'm like, oh, I want to try that. Oftentimes that's happened with my best friend and I. We share like what we're eating or what we're cooking and then she'll tell me I do this with my food or we often buy this or her daughter's into this lately and I'm like, oh. I need to add that to my list so that's something that i really enjoy and appreciate when i watch on youtube so if you guys are interested in anything like that comment below and let me know but other than that i'm gonna go ahead and get this going because like i said i think i have about an hour left before elias wakes up and i need to get this done so i'm gonna go ahead and get that started
little snack. Yeah. Hi. Mmm. How'd you nap? Boop. Mm. What happened? Mm. You wanna pick this up? <laughs> there we go. Wow. What are you doing? <laughs> are you working? You want butter? Okay. Don't spit that out, sir. That's exactly what you do. Okay. Hold on. I'm going to put butter. Do you want butter? No? It's a little, it's a little hot. Pardon the hair, guys, but I'm literally editing the video that you've just watched right now and realized that my ending clip did not make any sense whatsoever because I ended up uploading the Love Every video prior to that one. Um, and yeah, it just wasn't going to make sense. So I was like, let me just quickly record an ending the way I look. It's literally um, 7.13 and it is Thursday and I'm planning on uploading this video tomorrow, but I just wanted to obviously thank you for watching and also... Um, yeah, like the video, subscribe if you're not already subscribed to this channel, and comment below anything you'd like to see in the future. Um, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye! Ha <laughs> ah.